Hello everyone, welcome to my today's video. During working on ASA firewalls, there are many times I need to review the firewall rules. I used to only get the text-based configuration files, which include everything inside of it. But it makes me very hard to search and filter in the rules I need. In this video, I'm going to show you a way I just learned to convert your text-based configuration firewall rules into an Excel spreadsheet. Let's start it. This is a Cisco ASA uh, configuration. I'm going to use it as an example. When we scroll down, you can see there's not much firewall rules shows here. Uh, but uh, when you review in a large ASA configuration file, which maybe includes hundreds or thousands rules and thousands of network objects, groups, and AT rules, then it's going to be painful to search and filter in and out. What I found is that I can use another tool, third party tool. This is firewall audit tool I found, which is very helpful. The name is Warpath. You can find it from warpath.com. The program hasn't been updated since July of 2017, but still works. Um, as you can see, there are two download links, exe installation file link and the 7z uh, archive package link. The interface is showing all lures, network object interface, and it lures, which is enough for me to use. So I'm going to show you from downloading and uh, how to import the configuration file, and then how to export it, and how to import it into the Excel. All those steps. Please download this 7z file, which you are including all files you will need to run and you don't have to install it. If you haven't installed 7-zip, then you can find it from online and install it for free. So what I did is I just extract it into the Warpath folder, double-click Warpath, then you will get a web GUI interface. Um, this is commercial licensed file. You do have child for 30 days, which I got a uh, uh, child license will expire 2021, July 2nd, this notification. Each time when you run it, you will get this notification until you register it. So, but we can run it the child mode, child mode. So just to learn how it looks like, how it works. Click the file and then just open the configuration file, ASA, text-based configuration file, which I put on the desktop. So it will give you a warning message, but you can say feel safe to uh, ignore it, just say yes. Then we will see all interfaces and AT rules object. In this example, we don't have much, but uh, imagine in a big organization, they have thousands network objects, which are gonna be had take for you to search them and then in a text-based file and then filter them out. That will be painful. But with this software helps, we can easily see them in this web query. If you know SQL language well, you also can Construct your SQL uh, filtering language here and then just filtering whatever you need. It. To make it simple for me and for most people, we will just do export. We're going to export everything out, I mean, firewall rules, obviously, out to a new text file. Gonna save it on desktop. We can take a look what has been 
export it. This is CSV file, so they have special format which we can import it into our Excel. Let me show you that. I open the empty Excel spreadsheet. What we can do is go into the data menu and then we're gonna get the data, get the external data from text file. So that's a text file. We export it, open it. You will see there's a couple options to describe your data. Best option is delimited. We are not using fixed width uh, type of data. We're using delimited. We are not using tab. We are using pipe sign to separate those columns. Next. And then click finish. It's asking where do you want to put the data. So we're going to use a new worksheet. Just correct OK. So all five rules will be showing here. You do see there's a no header for each column, which you have you will have to manually type them in. This is actions, interface groups, protocol source. Those things you have to manually type in. So we can add a new row on top of it. Action interface protocol source source port destination destination port remarks here is warnings after that you can enable filtering For example, you only want to see DMZ rules, you can just filter it by DMZ rules. Or maybe you want to see only specific source, you can filter it by source or specific destination. That will make your firewall policy review much easier. So that is all I want to show you using a third party software to convert Cisco ASA firewall configuration files to a readable, filterable, and searchable Excel spreadsheet. Hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, give me a thumb up and subscribe my channel if you haven't. Thank you.